Well, yes, I didn't think I was going to be posting this video today. I had a completely other video in the can, ready to go. The thumbnail's done, but now I got to hold off another day posting the video I wanted to post today. So it'll be posted tomorrow, Friday, the 11th, because I got to post this one right now. Because yesterday, the John Lennon Mind Games Meditation Mixes were released. Officially, October 9th. Okay? And I didn't buy it. I ain't going to be buying it. You saw my video review of the song, Yes, about a week or so ago. Go check out that video. But I listened to it last night. I got in the mood, lowered the lights, lit the candles, tried to get in an intimate mood with Mrs. Street, and it didn't work. <laughs> it, it, it ruined everything. Okay, I did sit and listen to the entire Mind Games Meditation mixes. Uh, nary the, or I should say without the uh, mantras. Okay, they weren't included in my Spotify release. But I listened to the rest of the album last night completely through. And then I listened to it with notes this morning, taking notes. So I have my notes and everything, which I'm gonna tell you about it. I wanna get out of here. I, so this is a Mad Matt video, okay? You know my Mad Matt series? Go see the other three videos in the Mad Matt series. I recommend it. Folks, I shouldn't have to clarify, okay? You know I like the Beatles. You know I like John Lennon. Folks, I even appreciate and respect Yoko Ono and Sean Ono Lennon, yes. Okay, I like music by Yoko. Certain music, certain things she's done, I like. Same with Sean Lennon. I like things Sean Lennon has done. So I'm not a hater, okay? I don't hate anybody, all right? But you gotta give me a chance here because folks, I'm tired of like nobody speaking their mind, okay? I see a lot of people who just want to kiss Fanny, uh, lather up the rump and do some rump swabbing and that's what i see and observe now i'm not putting anyone down if someone likes the john lennon mind games meditation mixes more power to them but folks in, in a in a nutshell it's been done okay folks it's been done all right anyone who's done or listened to world music or this new fandangled contemporary instrumental music, or you want to get it even more spacey, new age music. Ooh, yeah, it's been done. Go listen to Yanni, okay? He's got a million albums out there. Or if you want something that's a little more spiritual and faith-filled, go listen to John Tesh, all right? And I can name a million other artists. It's been done, folks. Now you say, well, not in the pop music world, Matt, all right, folks. Yes, it's been done. And I have two albums that prove it, all right? One is a recent album within the last year by Lord Huron. The album's called Long Lost, and the track on it is called Time's Blur. It's about 14 minutes long and much better than anything on the John Lennon Mind Games meditation mixes, all right? But very similar in its vibe and mood-inducing spirit. So go check that out. And then go back almost 30 years ago, Queen's final album called Made in Heaven, 1995, a couple of years after Freddie passed away tragically, Queen put out an album. Great album, by the way. I like it. Even though it was like stuff thrown together, it's a great album. The last track on Made in Heaven is called Untitled. It's 22 and a half minutes long, of the same shite that's on Mind Games Meditation Mixes, all right? But it's not shite. I just mean, I'm just trying to get dramatic here. Folks, it's essentially the same damn thing, all right? If anything, I like Untitled on Made in Heaven better because you know the whole theme of the album is about Freddie's passing and moving on to, the, to heaven and the next life and all that. And it's so... The, the sounds and, and the, the vibe it, it, it epitomizes just makes you feel like it's like listening to the journey towards heaven. That's the, the way Queen put it together with, you know, Freddie's voice coming in and out and stuff. Very similar to the meditation mixes. 
uh, folks, what I'm saying, I'm not here to put down Sean or Yoko or, or John, for that matter. If you like this stuff, you like it. Go dig it, all right? But, folks, I listen to them. I listen to them 10 minutes long, 11 minutes long, 5.5 minutes long, 6 minutes long. These are the tracks. Uh, 6 minutes long, 5 minutes long, 23 minutes long, 33 minutes long, 12.5 minutes long, okay? First one is called Mind. Again, totally reminded me of the untitled track I Made in Heaven or the track, like I said, by Lord Huron called um, Time's Blur, which is 14 minutes long. It's the same stuff, folks. It's been done before, all right? Mind just reminds me of those two tracks so much, but done not as well. Magic. Same shite, <laughs> all right? Same shite, sound bites. A little more intense than Mind, but Magic, same stuff. Third track, Space. Essentially the same, same thing. Repetitive over and over again. Seed. Still Mind Games, the song Mind Games being varied with the same mood-inducing shite, you know? Same thing. Yes, I reviewed this one, yes, about a week or so ago. Go check out my review. Um, it was the first one that was released to the public, and uh, I called it a boring dirge, and it hasn't changed. Okay, it's still boring. Uh, Spirit, same shite. <laughs> same shite, different track, okay? Surrender, 23-plus minutes long. Oof. So this time we get more time, so it has more time to build. So it builds into more intense shite, more grandiose shite, <laughs> majestic shite, <laughs> okay? Peace, 33 minutes long, again, builds to grandiose, majestic, intense shite, all right? And the last track is love, and more of the same, okay? <laughs> Basically, only 12 minutes long, 12 and a half minutes long. And, you know, John's voice is, you know, softly coming in and out of the mix. You know, love is the answer. Mind games forever. You know, all that. <laughs> Folks, I, I, I know I'm being a little bit fresh, mad, mad here. But, you know, if you're into it, if you're a completist, you have to have everything. And, yeah, get the meditation mixes. Or you just love the foil sparkly cover and the great packaging with the ultra clear vinyl that you can look through and see your neighbor you know that kind of stuff great great go for it folks go for it but for me I, it's just it's not worth it it's not worth it folks it's just not uh you want great mood inducing stuff go get yanni go get john tesh all right or you want it in the pop realm go get lord huron uh times blur 14 minutes of Really cool mood-inducing sounds, all right? Or Queen, the untitled track, I Made in Heaven. Really well done, all right, if you're into that stuff, all right? I'm not really into it, but if I had to pick my favorites, it would be the track I Made in Heaven and the track by Lord Huron. But the Meditation Mixes by John Lennon? No, I'm sorry, folks. They're not that good. So I... I, I mad, mad here. Sorry, folks. I tried. I told you I would try and be honest. I'm being honest. Someone has to be honest here. And it's just, unless you're a completist, which I'm not, this ain't worth a shite to me. <laughs> Love you all. Bye-bye.